Okay, just a quick video this time. Well, hopefully a quick video. We just want to introduce AC theory. We're just going to look at waveforms for being able to calculate uh, RMS peak voltage uh, and alike. Uh, but let's first of all, let's have a look at a waveform and be able to define some of the aspects of it. So if we've got a waveform like this, then the first thing we want to do is be able to define what the uh, the peak voltage. So the peak voltage uh, is up from the, the center line, so from the naught volt, so I'll just label that on there for us now. So there we have our peak voltage, and in this case, it's going to be equal to 8 volts. Okay, now we've got our, our peak voltage, then we need to label our peak to peak. So our peak to peak is from the bottom to the top, so there is our peak to peak. So in this case, our peak to peak voltage is 16 volts. Okay, last thing we want to do then is do look at a time period, so the time for one cycle. So it doesn't matter where you take it, so it's just wherever it's convenient. So you can take it from a from one peak to the next peak, you can take it from a trough to a trough or a center line, so wherever is convenient. So let's have a look, see where it might be. Okay, so there we have our time period, and then we're, all we have to do is to, is to see how far it is. Uh, well, in this case, we can see that our time period is two squares. So our time period is, is, is two squares. And each square is worth uh, one millisecond. Okay, so then that makes that then to be two milliseconds as a time period. So then last of all, we can then define what the frequency is. So frequency equals one over our time period which in this case equals uh, 500 hertz, so frequency measured in hertz. Okay, so there we have it. So the next thing I wanna work out is RMS to peak voltage. RMS being root mean squared. So um, not a bit of a wishy-washy definition, but it's uh, all of our AC signals are quoted in RMS voltage voltages, and it's sort of um, the voltage, the equivalent voltage if we had a DC power supply that's what the RMS would be uh, but we calculate do any calculations with uh, peak voltage uh, so because as I say quite often it's it's referred to in RMS so in this case we've got uh, we've got the peak voltage so we'll we'll do backwards to work out the RMS voltage uh, and then we'll do something else to to work out the RMS so in this case we've got uh, RMS, uh, we're looking to find our RMS voltage, so we've got our peak voltage, which is 8 volts, divided by uh, root 2, uh, so then that gives us a voltage of 5.65 volts RMS. So you always find that the RMS voltage is less than the peak. Peak top, okay, uh, we'll do one vice versa. So if we have 7 volts, uh, 7 volts RMS, uh, when we want to find out the peak voltage, then we can do it backwards way on. So in this case, voltage RMS times by uh, root 2, so we're going to have, uh, was it 7 times root 2, um, uh, which equals 9.9 .9 volts. Okay, marvellous. Okay, so another thing we can work out is the average voltage, so we're working at the average voltage for one cycle. Uh, so the formula we've got is uh, 2 over pi times the peak voltage so if we use our example uh, use our example we're going to say our voltage peak um, um, is 8 volts then our average voltage is going to be 2 over pi times by 8 volts uh, which equals then 5.1 volts and um, one last calculation then, just for the sake of it, I think more than anything else, uh, we've got we've got what's called form factor. So we've got RMS voltage over our average voltage. Okay, uh, so we've just worked out the average voltage um, when we had a peak voltage of 8 volts, so it was 5.1 volts, and what was the RMS voltage? You might just have to scroll up to have a look, see what that was. Uh, okay, so what was that? Uh, 5.65 volts. So that gives us a form factor of 1.1. Marvellous. I think calculation for the sake of 
calculations there, but certainly the peak uh, RMS conversion is very, very useful, very, very uh, valuable. Uh, you'll use that time and time again. Okay, uh, hopefully this was a short video. I'll soon know when I uh, look at it in a, in a second. Uh, all for now. Bye.